Good afternoon, everyone. Today is a somber one for the KX team here, and I'm not going to cry. I told myself I'm I not going to cry. If you need it. And I have <laughs> tissue, so we are prepared. But Tom, there are no words to tell you what you've not only done for KX, but for North Dakota. And um, I know you hate surprises, but um, I have a surprise for you, just for you to look okay. back over your time. I will here, do that. Thank take you. a look. Good evening, I'm meteorologist Tom Schrader. Well, the severe weather continues to rumble across western and north central. There are few people who rise to the level of legendary, but KX News' Tom Schrader is one of the few who has earned that title in more ways than one. Ask anyone. So inspiring. Very, very giving. Very dependable. Genuine. Their biggest cheerleader. He's just the best guy. He gen genuinely was a team player. If there was something that needed to be done, he would volunteer to do it and, um, you know, would offer up any kind of assistance that he could. So um, that, that really hasn't changed, though, throughout all of the years, too, knowing Tom. In 1996, Tom captured viewers' hearts with an intense passion for weather and his devotion to North Dakota. How did we get so lucky? The next big storm we're watching, however, is this big low out over Siberia. I'll never forget the day that Tom came to interview for the job. It was in February, and it was 14 below zero, Tom tells me. Uh, and he was flying in from Phoenix, of all things. And I just thought, oh, there's no way he's going to take this job. You know, no way he's going to say yes. Despite the frigid days. In the mid to upper 30s. Ah, oh, it's going to be pretty nice tomorrow. He moved his life to the Magic City. Now, 26 years later, with his roots firmly planted, he embodies everything North Dakota stands for. Loyalty, hard work, and tradition. Hey, Tom. Hey, Tom. Hey, Tom. Hey, Tom. How's the weather? How's the weather? How's the weather? Hey, Tom. How's the weather? Tom Schrader goes hand in hand with North Dakota weather. I've had people come up to me over the years and tell me that hearing his voice during severe weather has made them feel safe. Even though a lot of the time he is in the studio, you know, giving the forecast, he sees it as he's in someone's home and he's talking to them personally. Your weatherman. Kind of a whammy of a storm tonight. A mentor. Make sure you have a KXMD TV winter survival kit in your vehicle. A best friend. Mom and Heather rolled up their sleeves and set up shop for the season. A husband and a father. I've got my son, Nick, he's helping me here, so go ahead and keep putting those in there and we'll get six really good ones, all right, Nick? When I was younger, I remember going into the studio at three o'clock in the morning for severe weather to keep all the viewers and everybody safe. Um, he's such an amazing weatherman and an even more amazing father. To have him there Everybody? by my Everybody. side on the desk uh, throughout all those hours was absolutely invaluable. He will be in our history books. Tom Schrader is weather in western North Dakota and he has been for decades now. Tom's on-air chapter may be closing, but the guiding voice of North Dakota will never be forgotten. For tomorrow, it'll be partly cloudy early in March. Okay, you're getting, okay, that was the other thing. The weather details for the weekend and beyond, they're coming I've out. been honored to be invited into people's homes uh, for 26 years. It's something that I uh, will never forget, and uh, I, I'm just honored they trusted me. Thank you, Tom, for being there for everybody. Thank you, Tom, for everything. I just love you so much. I hope you have the best retirement. Congratulations. I love you, Tom. You go, brother. We love you. Love you, Dad. Love you, Tom. Love you, Tom. We love you so much. Love you, Tom. And hey, Tom, how's the weather? Thank you, Tom. So much for everything. I, I just don't know what to say. Um, and I can guarantee you that there isn't a day that I worked that there wasn't somebody helping me. So to give me all the credit, no, because I always, always, always had help. You really paved the way for so many people. And I think I speak for all of North Dakota when I say you are truly, truly going to be missed. Thank you so much. And congratulations on 26 amazing years. Thank you so, so much. Thank you. Mm -hmm. Thank you. Thanks. Am I supposed to do my last look? Right here? <laughs> I know we were debating yeah. to see if yeah. you would do last look, no. but... Um, don't go away. And... Uh, <laughs>
<laughs> um, okay. Maybe we can toss it back to Joel. Yeah. We're crying over here, so we might need a few minutes. <laughs> you know, actually, I, I'm talking to the producer. Oh, there we go. Oh, I'm going to do the last look. Joel, is that okay? Yep, ready when you are. Okay, I'm going to do the last look. 